When water level drops down in winter, people of northern Afghanistan, who has the skills of collecting gold and sand, arrive at the banks of river along with their daily use items. Gold finding is a very tiring job and requires great physical efforts. The first step in gold finding is identification of places which contain particles of gold. To find the area which contain gold particles, sample of sand is taken into shovel. Then shovel is dipped into water to check that sample has any gold particles. When the gold containing area is identified, workers start digging off lane. Then wooden tray is filled with mixture of sand and gravels. Sand and gravel's mixture is brought to inclined, flayed carpet cover surface. Where water is continuously poured on mixture to separate sand from gravels. Because of high density, gold specks trap on carpet and other minerals discharge off to river with water. For gold searchers, most important tool is their wooden pen. Pen is round flat tool used to separate smallest particles of gold from sand. Finally, paint is dipped into water and subsequently pieces of carpet are squeezed into paint. To separate particles of gold from sand, paint is continuously moved in a circular direction. Painting process continues until gold separates from sand. <laughs> 